Howdy, I'm Jeff Totes with Aggie Athletics, and today I'm joined by junior defensive end Julian Obioha. As always, today's exclusive interview is brought to you by Academy Sports and Outdoors. Now, Julian, you're one of the few guys on this defensive line, really with a lot of ga uh, previous game experience. What would you assess your role to be this season in terms of leadership for this unit? You know, it's a, it's a lot bigger. You know, we have a, a lot more young guys. We have a, the coaches did a great job of recruiting a lot of freshmen that can play this year. So there's going to be times where I'm on the field where I might be the only person with game experience. I got to make sure I get these uh, young cats lined up and make sure they're doing their jobs. And you've seemed to indicate this offseason that you've seen a lot of improvement in the defense from last year to this year. What have you specifically seen out here at fall camp that supports that? There's a lot more veteran presence. You know, there's uh, there's times where we're all lined up and we all know exactly what to do. We're all on the same page. That didn't happen a lot last year, you know. So the main thing is a lot more veteran presence. There's a lot more leadership. And you mentioned it earlier, also a lot of freshman talent on this defensive line. What have you seen from them so far out here at camp? And if you could kind of assess where they're at right now versus where you remember being at that time freshman year. You know, uh, back when I was a freshman, you know, the coaches couldn't meet with us during the summer. so. Uh, I was a little, I was a lot farther behind than the freshmen are now. But you know, Coach Price did a great job meeting with each freshman uh, and getting them on a, a good page. And uh, a lot of them are in their playbook. They know what to do, and uh, they're all hard working. They're all hungry to learn. They're all hungry to play. So every single freshman I see out here, he's, he's a talented guy. He's a hardworking guy, and he's ready to play. And how much are these freshmen bringing to the table in terms of energy and drills? You're going against them every day, and who in particular surprised you? You know, uh, the freshmen bring so much energy to uh, each and every drill. You know, there, there was times when <laughs> we'd be worn out last year because we had five or six guys. Now we have 10, 12 guys. So there's so much energy, so much, so many new people, new faces. And, you know, I've been surprised by everybody. You know, uh, when it's it's hard to play as a freshman. There's so You're in a new place, a uh, new playbook, so many new things. So it's harder, you know, adjust to a new system. And I've been surprised by everybody. Everybody's been working hard and everybody's been in their playbook. And lastly, Kenny Hill named starting quarterback this past Saturday. What have you seen lining up across from him so far out here at camp, and what are your expectations for his season? You know, uh, e either either uh, either uh, person that the, uh, that the coaches picked to start would have been a great would have been a great choice. You know, uh, I saw a lot of Kenny. Kenny showed a lot of composure when the play would, when the play would break down. Kenny would make a lot of plays with his feet. So it was just it was uh, it was good. Kenny's good.